So there folks, welcome back to XCOM. Uh, we have a mission, we have a mission from the council, uh, which is not that. I don't feel the council mission, into the mission control, target escort mission is what we're going to do. Before we do, I want to change our research project. I noticed last time we were about to start researching the new fighter craft. However, we captured a floater alive. And I've got a sinking feeling that if we interrogate this guy, we might get research credit for the fighter craft, which would pretty much half how long it's going to take to research that. Um, so it'll bring us from 20 days down to 10 days for the new research. So we're going to take the risk. We're going to interrogate this guy. It'll take three days. Uh, by the time we get back of our mission, a couple of days, that's done. And then we'll know for sure whether we get research credit against flight or not, which I'm pretty sure we do. Uh, right, what do we want to do? We want to click Target Escort. So it's a council mission, uh, which means it's not as difficult as the standard missions. In fact, it should be reasonably easy. Usually these missions involve a lot of thin men and very little else. Uh, we will get global panic reduction for doing this. Um, so we don't need to take... Mm. So we don't need to take all our good people. For example, the sniper. Now that we have Iron Will, we basically want to stop taking this guy and train up another sniper. So, before we do anything, we're going to take this guy's stuff off. Uh, we're going to take that off, take that off, take that off. Um, and then we're going to clear him out. And the reason I'm doing this is because he's only got 53 will. We saw him panic last mission. Now we have iron will. If we level someone up, they will get a big will bonus. Um, Jennifer Lopez is our other sniper. So if we bring her in, she's already got will 48. And she's only a squaddy, so she's going to go up like, you know what is it, six, seven levels, and get a massive will boost each time. So she's going to end up with way more will than Peter Andre, and therefore less likely to panic. Um, so let's equip her. Let's give her some stuff. She wants laser pistol and scope. Pretty good going. Uh, we also want to give her the decent armor and color it up. If I go this way, it was one of the green looking ones, wasn't it? Was that it? I think that's it. Looks about right. Uh, okay, so we have our new sniper. Who else are we bringing on this mission? We've got two assaults. Uh, we've got two supports by the looks of things. And a heavy. Okay. Let's clear this support out for a sec. Where is the other support? Is he injured? He is injured. Okay. Okay, so yeah, I suppose we'll take her as a support. What level is she? Sergeant. Yeah, it never hurts to level up some extra support, so let's do that. Uh, she'll want the laser rifle and the med kit. And she'll also want proper armor. Let's do that. Uh, it's, is it that red? No, it's not. It's the other one. Gotta make sure she's outfitted correctly, guys. It's just the way it is. That's the one. Go back. That one. Okay, right. Two supports. New sniper, we've got a heavy over here. Let's just clear her out for a second, look at the other heavies we've got. We've got a low level heavy down there that we could do with training up as a replacement. So, let's unequip this high level heavy. Uh, what's she got? She's got 63 will, 77 aim. So yeah, the replacement heavy, if we start training her up, will eventually end up with more will as well. Uh, so we want to take off carapace armor, and that's it, isn't it? That's all we need. Clear her out. Bring the other heavy on. Uh, that one. Edit unit. Give her the carapace armor. Oops. Can also give her the alien grenade. No reason not to. Uh, and then she just wants armor. That's the right color already, isn't it? Yes, it is. Okay, so. We've, we're going to keep the high level support. No, uh, sorry, the high level assault with us. Uh, so that he, we've still got some firepower, basically, to bring against these aliens. We don't want them dicking all over us. But this should be a nice, simple, easy mission. Let's hope we draw a nice map that's not too difficult. And if we can dick all over this, get everyone some good level ups, get the sniper leveled up, definitely. That's an important thing to do right now, is to feed kills to the sniper as quick as possible. We're heading to South Africa for this one, and we need to get down there fast. Okay, I'm going to South Africa. Right. 
Okay. Okay, this is not a terrible map. We can do this. Uh, right. One thing I do know about this map is there's a nice roof spot that we want to get our sniper on where she can pick up lots of kills. Um, we've only got to get this guy to the evac zone. Although something you can do on these maps to cheese it up is you just leave him standing somewhere and the aliens just keep on spawning. But that's a bit cheap. We're not going to do that. What we are going to do is we're going to move one squad up to this door. Uh, which is going to be the sniper. We could do with one of the supports over there as well. So I'll put a support over there. Um, and probably the heavy. And they're going to bust out of that door in the next turn. In the meantime, our other guys are going to prep to go through this door. Uh, so we've got another support. We've got an assault. Oops. Oh well. Never mind. Shut up, civilian. No one cares. Uh, the assault. The other assault. Get off. I can overwatch. No aliens are going to come in this turn. It's absolutely fine. We'll bring the civilian up as well. We're going to push him out from this side. It's a bit more... A bit more safer for him. Uh, and this assault as well. Let's just bring him up right in front of the door. <clears throat> right. We'll just end turn. We don't need to watch overwatch or anything. Nothing's going to come through on the first turn. Right. This guy. Let's get this door open. Can you open the door? No. Can you open the door? Thank you. Okay. He may spawn something as he comes up to this window. Which, which guy have I got selected? I want this one. Thank you. There we go. There we go. A couple of thin men outside, as I suspected. Ah, one's gone up onto the roof. Oh, no, he's come back down. Ah, <laughs> derp. Um, he's flanking me, but we've got a reasonably good shot at him there. So let's, let's take that. We want to keep these guys down, clear them out, bring the civilian through once the poison dissipates. That's the plan. Um, the support can't see him from there, so we could do with bringing her to a better spot. <clears throat> right, can we see anything in there? No. Okay, let's move her through. From what I've observed so far, it's clear right, before we move those guys, let me open this door. See if we see anything else. Looks good so far uh, we want to move someone it annoys me that these railings don't really count as cover uh, we're probably best staying in the doorway for now 47% that's not very good at all what's our support got 64 let's take that see if she can hit him she did excellent okay okay so now we want to overwatch and we'll bring the civilian up just one square and then put his hunker down. Bring the sniper up one square. Might as well hunker her down. Bring this assault through. He's going to want to push out of this door, I think, with the uh with the support on the next turn. We're basically trying to secure the perimeter. So that we can bring the sniper up, stick her on the roof. There was some sort of weird symbol over there then. I'm not sure what that was. Uh, right, who do we want to push out? Let's push the heavy out first, I think. That's probably the best idea. See if she sees anything. She doesn't. Okay, brilliant. Uh, so let's whip the sniper out into this spot up here. Ah, there you go. She spotted something over there. Now, she can't take a turn because we've just used double move to get her up there, but it means she's in position now to watch over the, pretty much the entire field. So, all we've got to do now is clear these guys up with what else we've got. So, we've got a support who can move to this box for full cover. Or to that spot. That's even better cover. Let's put her there. She can fire on that one for 64. It's probably a hit. Oh, beautiful shot. Look at that. Okay. Okay. What have we got left? We've got the heavy. 27%. That is some feeble shit right there. Uh, right. Let's open this door. Doesn't look like there's anything out there. 
Um, let us... Do we want to send... Where's the support? Send the support out to have a look on this side. Looks good. I'm going to bring her around to full cover and leave her there. Civilian. Uh, we're going to leave you for a sec. I want this poison to dissipate so it doesn't go running through it. Uh, let's bring this guy, let's run and gun him. And we'll plonk him right there. Okay. Triggered another one. That's fine. Not a problem. They're only thin men. They don't hurt very much. Uh, I doubt he's going to be able to anything 1%. That is some feeble shit. What about with the pistol? 36. No. I'm going to leave you on overwatch. Right. So what have we still got over here? Can we get this guy with a grenade? Yes, we can. Let's do that. Kaboom. Have an alien grenade up your ass, mate. There you go. Okay. Who hasn't acted yet? Give me a soldier. We've got the civilian and Ben Affleck. Uh, what we're going to do is run and gun Ben Affleck. And he's probably going to run through the poison on his way there, but never mind. Can't really be helped. Guy's an idiot, what can I say? Uh, he still can't take a decent shot from there. What about with the pistol? 9%. Feeble. Get some overwatch on. So all we've got left is the civilian. Uh, we could hide him. We can't quite get to the truck. We could bring him over there. I think that's a reasonably safe spot. Or we could just bring him into double cover in the house. Let's do that. I don't think the thin man's going to be able to shoot him over there. He's in a pretty good spot. Right, so most thin men are going to teleport in in a moment. Okay, both of our assaults have been poisoned, but never mind. Oh, looks like we've got a thin man dropping in right over here. Harsh. Someone just took a reaction shot. Oh, it was him. He missed, though. Great. <laughs> good work. Fucking good work. Is it our turn? It is our turn. Right. Well, she can take him down. That's a nice, easy shot. <laughs> right in the face. Uh, that does leave poison where we wanted to move the civilian to, but never mind. Right. Sniper. Sniper needs some kills. Wow. Amazingly, she cannot see that guy. Does she not have squad sight yet? Let's have a look. No, she doesn't have squad sight yet, that's why. Uh, okay. Well, not a problem. Not a problem. We'll send somebody in to kill him. Um, he is in a very fucking awkward position, though. That's the problem. We need to move this guy out of this fucking cloud anyway. So let's move him... Oh, God. He can't run and gun at all, which is a bit annoying. So wherever we move him, it's probably going to take a full move. Uh, okay, let's do it anyway. Let's move him out the poison. And uh, we'll move this person up and see if she can take a shot at him. Forty-four percent. We'll, we'll give that a shot. Go on. Oh, you bastard! Okay, we've got one right at the back over there as well that I didn't even bloody notice. Uh, we're going to have to move the heavy up quite far. Let's bring her up that side. This is a very awkward, awkward mission. I didn't realise we didn't have a squad sight on the sniper. Right, we're going to hide this guy in the truck. <clears throat> he should be safe in there. And the sniper can overwatch. And then if anyone moves, at least she can take a turn. Oh, we've still got Affleck to move. Um, although not many good places we can put him, really. We could double move him up. I think that's probably going to be the best idea. Just double move him up. He'll probably take a hit. But what can you do? Ah, he's going to overwatch that guy. Right. Give me... Give me that assault guy back. Where was he? Somebody could see an alien that was... F oh, no. It said he was flanking him a minute ago, but now he's not. Never mind. Boom. Dead. 
One more left hiding behind the truck. Let's bring this guy this side. There he is. There's not many places he can hide. Uh, we might as well just put him on overwatch now, as soon as though we can't find him. Uh, we'll move her up this side. Now, although she could do with reloading, we're going to overwatch, because I think this guy's going to come running out into our line of fire on the next turn. Uh, the heavy can't quite get to a good spot. We could bring her up the back. No, I don't think that's a good idea. What we'll do is we'll move her in to where this door is. And at least next turn we can open the door if he doesn't make a move. Uh, this support... We really want to leave her somewhere close. We don't want to take her too far away because she's going to help watch the civilian. Uh, and the civilian himself... Hmm, we're going to leave him in there in full double cover because nothing can get to him there. Sniper back on Overwatch. We want to make sure there's no aliens left before we move him. There we go. There's the reaction shot I was waiting for. Oh, she missed. Bloody typical. He's now gone to Overwatch. Okay. The assaults are going to need some heals pretty soon. Uh, the sniper is proving pretty useless, actually. So, good job. Um, actually... Oh, she's only got a normal pistol, hasn't she? That's not good. Okay. We'll reload her laser rifle. And we'll send somebody else in to actually kill him. Uh, we've got this one here. The door is now open. So if she comes round this side... Oh, yes. Overwatch. Forgot about that. She's going to take a couple of damage from that. Shit. Three damage. And she's not even flanking him. You gotta be kidding. <laughs> oh, well, at least he's dead. So now our civilian can make a rush for it. Uh, it's pretty safe. So what we want to do is... Where is the actual civilian? How far can we move him? Um, I don't leave him too out in the open. We could put him in this house by that window. That seems like a pretty doable spot. Um, and then we'll just send, we'll leave the sniper up there on Overwatch. And we'll have the assault sort of positioned around here to keep an eye on things. Uh, I'm going to reload this guy. I'm going to move this guy up to... We'll just put him there, I think. That should be fine. Uh, switching back to his shotgun. We're going to Overwatch with his shotgun. Because if anything drops in close, it'll get an instant kill. Uh, so now we can bring the support... In where do we want to put the support? If we put it just near that generator, she should still be able to overwatch where the civilian is. Yep. We're receiving reports of heavy there we go. Another area. wave teleporting in. On your There's one on the roof. Hopefully the sniper can see him this time. That'd be nice. Oh no, someone's already taken a reaction shot. Look at that. Oh, he missed. That's a shame. I thought that would have been a pretty decent shot. Right. Where was the sniper? The sniper still can't fucking see him. Oh my god. This sniper is shit. <laughs> uh, right. So first things first, we need to take this guy down. There's only one of him. We're going to use some laser pistol shots, I think. 49%, that's not much, but it might be enough. One damage. Wow. That is pitiful. This guy, 52 with the shotty. 47 with the laser pistol. That's unusual. We'll take the higher accuracy shot with the shotgun. And we got him. So, what we want to do is... Get our dudes back on Overwatch. Uh, we're going to bring the heavy up into this truck for better visibility. And then Overwatch. And we'll bring her up to the window. And overwatch again. Oops, nearly reloaded. <laughs> overwatch. And the civilian. The civilian can probably just fucking run straight through, to be honest. Smashing through a glass window like a boss. There we go. Jesus, that was easy. 
my dad it was very easy like the VIP is so Pit didn't get any kills for the sniper at all. She was uh, pretty useless there. I honestly thought we might we might get some kills for her. I expected her to be cleaning up all around. She got nothing. Not having squad sight, that's the problem. We really do need to make sure she picks up squad sight a ASAP. Okay. Oh, she actually got promotion in any way for successfully completing the mission. So now we can take squad site for her. Brilliant. And already, look, her willy's up to 58, which was way better than uh, than Peter Andre. And she's got many more levels to go. <laughs> so hopefully now people are going to start getting big will boosts. This chick's only got 39 will for some reason. That is bad. We might have to eventually drop her from the squad altogether. Uh, we want to take Revive for her. Uh, Lady Gaga has earned the nickname Thunder. Fucking hell. 48 Will. Will is going to become very important in the late game. Uh, we're going to take Suppression. Miley Cyrus. Will 66. Very good. Uh, we're going to take Revive for you as well. And that is it. We didn't get much to come away with, but it's okay because the panic reduction was the big reward there. Uh, so hopefully that has. Oh. Well, shit. I was expecting a global panic reduction and it only gave a local one. Seven days till the council report. Well, bad news, everyone. Looks like we're going to lose Canada. <laughs> shit. Oh well, oh well, what can you do? Right, let's have a quick save anyway, and then we'll scan, see what happens, see if our research completes. Oh shit, son. Interceptors. It's a large UFO. I don't fancy our chances against this one. This is why we need the new fighter aircraft. These large UFOs are an absolute bitch to shoot down. Now luckily we've got two interceptors to throw at it. But there's a very real chance that it's going to destroy them. Okay. Send out the other one. Uh, what have we got? Raven 1. Send that out. Hopefully it can finish off what Raven 2 started. Oh, there we go. Right. Go for it. Please shoot it down. Watching that damage on the left there, it's not looking good, is it? Oh, we got it. Oh, that was close. Oh, so both our interceptors are very badly injured. We have shot down a large scout in Nigeria. Uh, we're gonna ignore it for now because what we're gonna do first is save and finish the episode there. <clears throat> and next time, we will be going to Nigeria to check out the crash ship. So, I'll see you folks next time. Bye bye.